What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Another episode of Chilling with Jay. If you're new to the channel, hit that like button and subscribe. If you're not new, welcome back, man. Got another video for you guys. Something a little different, man. Picked up a trailer today from the auction, man. We finna fix these doors and repair them. They rotted out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut this bottom half out, take that out, put all new wood in. Uh, they tried to fix it before, but they did a horrible job at it. So what they did was kept the rot here, and they just took this metal piece here and that metal piece and squeezed it together and put new new screws in it. But it chewed it all up. It don't look good, look bad. So what we're gonna do is uh, replace the wood. Like I said, cut it here, put another piece of wood, drop the two pieces of aluminum back down, bolt it through, and put plates on it. That way this won't look like that and it'll be stronger, be better than before. They did a horrible job the way they started the build, how they did it, but we're gonna try to fix it. Try to show you guys that uh, steel plate. What is steel plate at? Oh, okay. Uh, the steel plate, or they tried to fix it. Uh, the one door on the right side, we're gonna have to replace the whole entire door. See, this is what they tried to do. They put a steel plate there. They put this plate there to try to make it make sense, but actually made it worse. So we're gonna do it the right way. We took the door off. We're gonna do it this how it's supposed to be done. Well, you know what I'm saying? Making it better than what it was or how they had it. So we're gonna replace this whole piece the right side. And then we're just gonna save the left side top half and just cut the bottom left off. So just letting you guys follow the channel, follow the bill, man. I'm gonna get it done. DIY, do it ourselves, man. Sometimes you don't have to replace the dough. Trying to find this dough and get this dough, man. Cost too much time and money. We just gonna repair them and make it happen. Hope this video helps somebody out in the long run. If you buy a trailer and it be rotted out like that, I can't speak for every truck door, but this one here, we're gonna try to save it, make it happen. Save a couple dollars. So follow the channel, follow the bill. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. All right, you guys, let me get you all caught up, man. We got this finally cut. Finna get ready to just replace this. I think it's like 14. What it is? 17. 17. 17 by 44 we got it cut out just gonna replace this part got that piece uh peeled back screwed up so it won't be flapping in our face and all in the way uh at first we was just gonna replace the whole guts but we got some, some somebody messed up somewhere <laughs> <laughs> All the measurements were the wood too short. So what we're going to do is we're just going to um, cut this out and replace the bottom. And cut this uh, top left corner out and replace that. So like I said man we, we screwed up a little bit but we're going to make it happen. We're going to make it work. We're going to figure it out. So right now we're doing all our measurements. Measuring twice and cutting once. That old saying. So we're going to live by that today. So right now we finna get ready to cut this out and replace both bottom halves and then uh, try to get this done tonight, man, because this trailer is supposed to be in Tampa tonight. But if not, we'll get it there in the morning. So let me get back into it. I'm going to post up the camera so you guys can follow along, watch the bill. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, you need to subscribe. All right, you guys, don't try that at home without glasses. We on 
don't gotta do too much cutting, so don't try that at home without glasses. Always remember safety first. This is what they use on the doors now. We ain't gonna need it now. We're gonna take it back. We're gonna end up using the metal that we have. But yeah, God, they do use these on the back doors now. So we're gonna get back into it, man. Yes, sir. She looked brand new. Tell me what you guys think. Getting it done. So what you want to do now? Flip that down and screw through? Or you want to try to put something there? Well, what we got to do is you got to put a little piece there first. Or put a little... We got to... We, gotta, we can flip it down. Screw this side side down with a couple of little screws. Yeah. Flip it over. And the back side's where we gotta put something. Yeah. You know what I was thinking about? We should have did had a flat plate, like the plate that that plate right there. Yeah. We should have had that flat plate where we can uh screw on the oh, top. It's actually up here. That's what we should have had went across there. Yeah, we need two of them. We need this plate right here. Like well, if we had it cut cut with holes in it but see home depot sell this yeah with a bunch of holes in it okay i say we i we better off going to get that than trying to cut this and put holes in it because well, we can run that piece across there with all the holes in it like, uh, two inches on each side that's what i'm the saying together. it's the plates put one on front one on the back yeah yeah we go buy that plate put one on top one and on the bottom cover over it. yeah screw it all the way across you bought the glue to glue that right yeah all right yeah hell yeah all right you guys man we off to another store run until later on peace all right you guys we just made another store run this is what we came up with we got corner pieces but we're gonna bend them out flat so we can have more grip, more support. And we got some three-fourth screws. So we're gonna try to make this work, make it happen. Uh, I tested the screws in the holes and it only are going to circle hole. It's too big to go in the double hole. Like the washer that's on the screws, it, it, it won't go in the, yeah. So you got a sludge hammer to bend this out? 
finna get back into it, you guys. Trying to get it done, man. Let's get it done. screws all the way down and then we're gonna do the same thing to the other side this how they should have did it when they tried to fix it to make it more functionable so we're gonna do it right the first time even, even though this ain't the right way but we ain't buying no dope we gonna read we gonna repurpose refurbish whatever we gonna do. make it work we're gonna make it work Save a dollar, we gonna try to. Like I say, we gotta keep going. That's hard there. <laughs> oh yeah, that that good wood side. So we're going to try to put that on the other side too to support it better, make it stronger. Then we're going to uh, glue the metal back. Should be perfect. As good as perfect. As good as new too. One solid piece. Like I said, man, I just got the trailer today. I need like four more. Try to get some more. They telling me to paint it. I ain't finna paint this trailer. I'm just finna make it functionable. That's it. Fix these doors. Get it done. Make it work. gotta look pretty as long as she get the job done that's all that matters use what you have don't worry about what you don't got make what you do have work until you can afford better and that's what we doing today making what we have work All right, you guys, we got that side done. Finna get ready to flip it over and do the other side.
all right you guys it's later on this evening a mechanic still out here as you can see he got the rotted piece out right here on the left no the right right door right side he got all the rotted out replacing the wood got all the old tin off so we're going to up we're going to go ahead and use the white stuff on there so he's going to put a new piece of that from top to bottom but he got all the rot off now we got fresh good wood got to glue it glue it down drill new drill all the new hoses for the hinges put it back together I see why people buy new doors but we're getting it done we're getting it there and tomorrow morning peace what's up YouTube welcome back to the channel Say what? day two of building the doors man this door look brand new man well, I can't stay here all night man I had to go home and go to sleep but I just got here man getting y'all an update on the door man he did a good job boy this door look professionally brand new if that makes sense let me get up here and show it to you guys, man. Did a good job. Come here, Richard. Man, that's crazy. It look good, boy. It look good, man. Y'all can see how we button it up. We button it up at the bottom and button it up right here on the right. He ended up winning the he went and got some um some uh, aluminum from some scrap guy and ended up cutting it and putting it there to support that piece to the right. Man, it looked good, man. Hey, I wouldn't. Hey, to be honest with you, I wouldn't even put nothing on this. Yeah. It's in the inside. I'll leave that like that. The outside, what matters? Yeah. But that looked good, man. Golly, that looked good. That look professionally done. I think we can go running around fixing those, man. What you think? Yeah, too much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they'll pay. You know how much these doors cost? How much? They are expensive. They're like eleven hundred dollars a piece. Yeah, impact them. It depends on who you get them from. That's where I found them from. Yeah. I found somebody selling them online for eleven hundred, but. It's on back order, you got to wait. That's why I end up fixing these, cause I ain't got time to wait. We gotta put it to work. Like I said, you guys, man, that's crazy. This the inside of the trailer. That look good. Gotta do a little, little replacing the wood. We gotta replace that piece. Replace this piece. We don't want the merchandise to get ripped. So we're going to replace those two pieces. Screw this back down. Screw that back down. What we're going to do is just cut it out with a beam at and then bolt it back down instead of replacing the whole piece. We recycle over here. We don't let nothing go to waste. So we'll cut this out from beam to beam. Cut that out, put another piece there. We don't waste nothing. Everything get recycled. Man, if you could save a dollar, man, save a dollar, man. Look at that, man. She she can't win no beauty contest, but she up there and she look good. My mechanic did his thing. That look nice. That's crazy. That's crazy. What you guys think? If you haven't subscribe subscribe tell me what you guys think of that dough man i approve what y'all think that joker look good man you wouldn't even know we did that if i didn't record this video you wouldn't even know we built this dough because it looked that damn good
Now we gotta do the left side. We ain't think it was gonna take this long, man. This trailer supposed to be in, been in Tampa yesterday. So we just, all right, we finna build it, get it done. Call the driver back, pick it up. Man, we still, day two, still on the right side, though. So, like I said, man, we gotta do the left side, then we done. We didn't think it was gonna take this long, but that came out nice, though. But we gotta do another stow run, though. He's drilling all the holes in right now. We gotta do another stow run. Gotta go get some more of this white sheet right here. Go get some more of that and put it on the left side, but it looked good though. Just getting y'all an update, a part two. Yo! The truck! The truck! Drilling the holes through. Alright, you guys, we had to make another stow run. Had to get another sheet. What we had to do is, uh, this is two sheets. It's one whole sheet, and we had to cut a little bit off the last sheet. So what we're gonna do is put this sheet on the left side, and then the uh, third sheet that we have for pieces, we're gonna cut that to make it long and mount up just like this. these called corner pieces <laughs> the corner pieces bending the corner pieces out right now making them center pieces making them center pieces to make them look like that as y'all seen on the yesterday video gonna do the same thing on the opposite side trying to get it done this is crazy, man. It actually took longer than I expected. Somebody told me that uh, that you can get new doors for three hundred dollars a piece, but man, I, I'd rather do this than buy new doors and have to wait and run around and do that. This wasn't that bad, but she looked decent. Though. I used to have a sledgehammer. Yeah. Weighed like three times more than that one. That's why you catching hell, cause that one ain't the big dog. Yeah. Well. That's why you catching hell, cause that hell mean like the other one. What you know what I was gonna say?
All right, you guys, we blowing the trailer out right now. Finna get ready to paint the floor. Blowing it out right now. We finna get ready to paint the floor. We got the, um, had to make another stow run. Four stow runs in the last two days. So you can tell we ain't used to doing this. But we're gonna use the porch patio flow paint. Can cost $144, man. $144. So we're gonna paint the whole Florida uh, container, trailer. So we can uh, don't damage the merchandise. It can look way better than it is. Show y'all that before. All right, we got it all blowed up. Y'all can see the before. Let y'all walk through and see the before. Well, not physically walk through, but walk through with me. See the flow before. Then we're gonna do that after, after we done. Remember before. Getting it done, getting it done. Tell me what you guys think. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let's get it done. Back into it. This paint heavy as hell. Wonder why it costs $144. Alright, you guys. Let's get into it. Made it to the end. Got one little.
little spot left. And we can call this job almost done. you guys I'm done with the flow go check it out on the side though I don't know if I need a second coat or not we're gonna see though she look good yes, sir. she looking truly beautiful she almost dry still wet a little bit in some of the cracks I'll probably do a second coat, get these uh, holes better, that way you protect your merchandise, so that'll work, tell me what you guys think, don't forget, like, comment, and subscribe, you guys man the end is near boy the end is near we almost done drilling the holes for the hinges got her up y'all can see that before before we put that sheet on want to put a sheet over the whole door all right we did the left side well the right side over the other sheet i'm gonna do it just like that on the left side. End up bolting that back down. So instead of pulling it off, just bolted it back down. The end is near. Almost done. I bet a lot of you guys are gonna say, man, it was quicker. You just bought some new doors and bolted up. But it ain't the same price. It ain't the same price. It's the price difference between us creating some doughs and buying some new doughs. Somebody had told me they knew what doughs was for like 300 bucks, but I'm like, man, that ain't new. That gotta be used. Cause the cheapest I seen them was between seven and 11. I'm like, no sir. I'll create some, I'll make some. And here we are today. Making some. Tell me what you guys think.
Them the same screw? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They did have some new screws on this part. Where they tried to create something. Almost done, man. Finish line is very, very, very close and approaching. Let's get her done. Get her done. mechanic have one of these hammers that's how you know he's a true mechanic because this hammer is old as me so he's been doing this a long time Left side before, right side after. Before, after. So we're gonna make the left side look like the right side. Guys, we almost at the finish line. Finna get ready to put the other sheet on this left side door. sheet on full-time job full-time job
board slipped. All right, you guys, I want to show you guys the, the first quote on the flow. First coat. Keep sounding like I'm saying coke, but it's coke. I don't have to do it again. I just want to do a couple spots, though. Look good. Came out decent. Just want to do a couple more spots. That's all. Other than that, trying to get out of here, man. We're trying to get this trailer to Tampa tonight. I'm gonna do this part again. The metal, this metal part again. A couple more parts over here. But far as the beginning, the beginning looked good. She ready to roll. And I patched up the uh, holes that was in the wall. Patched up there and I patched up there. Cause it's getting too late. Yeah, it's getting too late. We gotta go. So I end up just patching it up with some of the, the material we had left. It's just so that wood won't catch the material of the furniture. So we got it all taped up, sealed off. Well, band-aid up what you call it so like I said you guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe got a lot of more videos coming we're always creating building making finding buying something now that we got it down we got all dead up now it's about time to hang up. Then we can finally get out of here. Guys, we got the other door up. Finally got it back up. The only thing left to do is bolt this down. Put the seals around the door. And then she's ready to go. Tell me what you guys think. 